Stop by. <laughs> All right, man, this next track, man, I'm going to do is, uh, it's You I Seek. Again, it's just, this actually, these two songs are coming off a project that I'm releasing, uh, shoot, whenever God says time. It's called the Urban Praise Project. I got a project I'll be releasing in the fall. It's called Substitute. And then after, shortly after that, maybe the end of this year, I'm still here. God delay is coming. The Urban Praise Project, the two songs that you hear tonight will be, will be released on that project. And it's just a worship CD. And just like, it's the songs that, you know what I'm saying, this Lord had me share just before, but then you know. Uh, this track right here is called It's You I See. Because the fact is, is that uh, some of us, man, it's like, uh, some of us still kind of caught in that, in that, in that whirlwind of just running after stuff that make us feel good. Running after stuff that, that, that satisfy our, our physical needs, but our spirit's still dead. Mm. And then some of us, you know, we didn't gave our life to Christ. You know what I'm saying? And we still seeking the wrong thing. We looking for the next job or the next hookup or the next connection, the next networking connection. And it's not bad. Some of the stuff we look for is not bad, but when we put it before Christ, Ooh. that's what the problem is. Come on. This is not bad for me to, you know what I'm saying, to want to have some money. Because, you know, to, to go to the studio, to record a CD, to press up stuff, that costs. But when I put that desire or that need, that financial need above my need for him, that's when my problems come in. That's when I start, you know, I'm running here and there trying to do any and everything I can to get my hustle on or to get my bread up. All right, all right. You know what I'm saying? I see it in, in, in Christian artists a lot of times. You know what I'm saying? Like, they run it from showcase to showcase, showcase to showcase. Just because they say you can win a thousand dollars here, you can win studio time here, you can win that cash just run around, you know, like they ain't got no vision. Yeah. And it's some of us, not just artists, some just regular people. That's how we've been living our life. And we fail to realize that if, if we get back to the fundamentals, to the to the main thing that it's about, which is Jesus Christ, that all the other stuff will open up. Come on. Whatever he has for us. Yeah. Amen. What he has for us will open up. Yeah. Just want just want what God has for you. Because sometimes when we get to looking around and we see that so-and-so look like they got it better than me or they got more than me or they get more opportunities than me, then, you know what I'm saying, we start covering and start having a little bad, funky attitude. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, Lord, help me to keep my eyes on what's mine. You know what I'm saying? And so, yeah, amen. Help me to keep my eyes on what's mine. So, yeah, that's what's up. Marty Martin, love the kids. <laughs> All right, man, it's you I see. Let's get it. Yeah.
I'm going after God, especially when he, he, he did already told you how you need to line up. You gonna find yourself walking up against walls. You you thinking you about to rise, but you hit the glass ceiling because God is not gonna bless those of us that already. Ha ah! ha!